how to make an automatic mining bot in Minecraft Bedrock and Java Edition. This AI automatically mines for you and deposits any loot into a chest. So as you can see, all of the loot gets deposited into this. For this, all you need is these command blocks right here. The first one and all of these are repeat and always active. So the first command is slash TP at E type equals Minecraft item. And then wherever your coordinates are for the block above your hopper. So you need it for the block above your hopper. So the block right here. I'm going to place a block here to show you. This is where you want your coordinates to be for where you want your hopper to be underneath it. And then the items get deposited into the chest. So the second command block right here. Again, all of these are repeat and always active. And this command is slash execute at at E type equals armor stand name equals and then capital AI and then run slash fill tilde minus one tilde tilde minus one tilde one tilde two tilde one air destroy and then the third command block right here this is the command slash execute as at e type equals armor stand name equals ai at at s run slash tp up arrow up arrow up arrow 0 0.03 so next what you need to do is go to an anvil and place in a name tag and then you need to name this to ai so make sure these are capitalized like they are in your command blocks. So once you've got your AI name tag, all you need to do is place down your armor stand in the direction that you want it to go. So for this example, I want it to go here, facing this direction. So I place it down facing forwards. Then all you need to do is put your name tag on your armor stand, and then it will start moving forward, and the loot will get teleported to the hopper and go into your chest. So as you can see, this is automatically mining, and you can make these AI bots do anything else in your Minecraft world as well, but mining is just one example. Now, what you need to do is make sure you have command block output and command feedback disabled. These are both game rules if you don't want to spam your chat. And also, this has a limited range by default, but you can extend it so it works anywhere in your Minecraft world using a ticking area. To learn how to make a ticking area in Minecraft Bedrock, check out the video on screen.